are given the arrow band. Okay, for the following number, we all already know the arrow band is 0 0.005. Then we need to check how many significant digitals for each number. A equal to 138, B equal to minus 0 0.0312. And C equal to 0 0.86 multiplied 10 to 4. Now you see, we don't know what what are the uh, exact values, right? Just like uh, uh, practice uh, uh, application practical problem, we don't know what are the exact values. But uh, we can estimate the error bound by 0 0.005. Now we need to estimate. Now we are obtain three results, A, B, C. Uh, we need to know how many significant digitals for each uh, number. Are you clear the problem? Okay, now we only know the error band. We need to, to uh, estimate the, the number of digitals, significant digitals. Okay, so we only have to use uh, the the formula. Okay, so the formula I write here again. X minus A less than or equal to 1 over 2 multiply 10 to K minus N. It's okay? So, here we, we need to know what is K and then N means the number of significant details. It's okay? And uh, here we already know the arrow band, so we need to write this arrow band to this form. Okay, so firstly we need to know what, what are the, uh, what, what are the uh, k for different a, b, c. For a, we write it in the normalized form. So first thing you need to write a into normalized form. So you move the decimal place, one, two, three. Okay, so 0 0.13800 0, 0, multiply 10 to 3. Okay, so that means uh, we know for A, K is 3. Okay, next for B. For B, also we need to move to the right side, uh, right here. Just the 1. Okay, so 10 to minus 1. Because move to right, so here minus, negative. It's okay? Okay, for C, just the normalized form, 0 0.86 multiplied 10 to minus 4. Okay, so we know K, K, different K, right? Okay, now, by the hypothesis, we know the arrow band is just 0 0.005. So, also we need to write the arrow band by 0 0.5 multiplied 10 to 1, 2, right? So, it is 2. Uh, minus 2, sorry, minus 2, okay? It's okay? So, 0 0.5 is 1 over 2, okay? Multiply 10 to minus 2. Okay, now, let's check for uh, A, B, C, one by one. Okay, for A, for A, okay, we know K is uh, just uh, 3, right? So, by this formula, this power minus 2 should be k minus n. So k equal to 3 for a, then 3 minus n equal to minus 2. Okay, now you know what is n, right? Then n is just 5. Okay, so what does it mean? It means a has 5 significant digitals. So that means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Even the two zeros are accurate, accurate, right? So we have 5 significant digitals. That means the 5 uh, digitals are, are correct, right? It's okay for you? Okay, so this is for A. Okay, continue. That's for B. You should know the arrow band is same, right? Because we are given the arrow band is the same. So again, 1 over 2 multiplied 10 to minus 2. 
But what is the different? K is different, right? Here is K for B. K is minus 1. Okay, so you should write by k minus n. So that means k is minus 1 minus n equal to minus 2. Okay, minus 2. So what is n? It's okay for you? Right. n is just 1. That means b has only one significant digit. Okay, so now you see here we have 3, 1, 2, we have 3 digital, digitals, but by the re result we know just the 3 is cracked. 1 and 2, they are wrong digitals. Okay, clear? Now you see, we are just given the arrow band and the numerical results. We don't know what are the exact values, but by the arrow band we can know how many significant digitals we have? It's okay? Okay, so for last one, C. Okay, again, the arrow band is the same. Okay, so for here, C, the K is just minus 4. So again, you should write minus 4 minus N equal to minus 2. Okay, what is N? n is a negative number, it is negative 2. What does it mean? n should be positive number, right? Okay, so it means c has no significant digit. Has no significant digit. That means totally wrong. Totally wrong. Has no significant digit. Okay, 8 and 6 are wrong, totally wrong. It's okay for you? So, this is the exercise. I, I, I hope you can practice by yourself again to make, uh, 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 make you, uh, sure you understand. Okay? So, this is the first lesson.